Hello, 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 all my machine heads. Boy, do I have something awesome to show you guys. I've got a brand, a brand, a brand new map by FDR Logging. Yay, this is absolutely fantastic. This map has had over a thousand hours tested on it for him from his team and it is now released i am super stoked this is going to be my realistic series we are going to play 6x speed three day see three day months and i'm going to record a lot longer than 30 minutes i'm just going to do an hour I've had some requests by some of the subscribers that I go a little bit longer and that I do away with the time lapses. But I do have some bad, 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 bad news. Hastings, North Dakota had to go bye-bye. Now, after I got done recording my video for last night, got it all done, I went to pull my new Holland tractor back in uh, to the shed. You guys saw how close I was to the edge, and it fell off the edge. And it went down and kept falling and falling and falling with me in it. So finally, I was able to tab out to another vehicle, and it crashed the game. Not only did it crash the game, uh, but it corrupted the file. So I got back into the game, and I... Uh, loaded back up my save file because I always back up my save files no matter what. Uh, when you record for a living, you back up everything. So I was able to load back up and I did some investigating. Remember how I told you guys that the that crop wilted? Well, I went back and I started with episode one and I noticed that it was ready to go. It was I double checked it, triple checked it, and I said, oh, it's ready to go. What's going on? It wilted in one day. I was so disappointed because I had the video all set up. Went into the XML files and found out that the growth cycle is set on very fast. Not just fast, very fast. And you can't fix it. There's no editing it. You can't do anything to it. And I'm, I, I know how to do mods. I know how to do XMLs. And you can't fix it. The growth speed. Even if you put the growth speed on uh, slow or off in the seasons menu. It still withers because I thought to myself, how absolutely crazy is that, that um, it wilted in one day. We were playing real time on that map. And here's the problem. And I've told you guys what my rules are. Uh, I don't, whenever there's an issue on a map, it's gone. And when you corrupt a file, it's double gone. The thing I'm disappointed about and I'm really sad about is number one, I like the map, but number two, it, I had over 13 hours on that map, and I, you know, we were only on day two. Frustrates the living crap out of me. But enough of that. That's done. I'm going to take a break from No Man's Land also, and this will be my primary Let's Play for a while. So let's get into the setup. We're going to do some setup. First of all, let me show you the map. All right, so zoom out. No matter what uh, level you start at, uh, Easy Farmer, Farm Manager, or Start From Scratch, um, you in Easy Farmer, you own the whole map. In Farm Manager or Start from Scratch, you have to buy the map. But it's only four hundred nineteen dollars to buy the whole map. Done. He said eventually that he's going to break these up into different plots and stuff. But for this iteration, I buy the whole thing, and I'm that's the I'm sticking to it. I love it. So now I don't have to worry about nothing. I own the whole map, and there's no one here but me. This is the No Man's Land Extreme. As Okay, so getting back in, all these dark areas on the map are densely wooded. All the silver or light areas are rocks. Okay, and then these down here are uh, lightly forested. There's Most of the dark areas are flat, so you can put farmland in here. And then these are uh, pretty flat down and through here. Then you start getting into some mountains up and through here. So it's tricky. We're going to use our treks. But let me start by saying 
This is going to be not only a farming map, but a mining map as well. I am going to do, uh, I'm going to mine some rocks with the Terra Farm mod. I absolutely love it. I spent about three hours on this map today playing around and getting different scenarios set up. So that's what we're going to do. Like, for example, we're going to come over here. We're going to cut all these trees down. And when we get over to the, um, what do you call this? They're the mountainous range. And we work our way around. See? You can go across there if you want. We're going to jump. Okay, we'll start, we'll terraform like a little path across this lake. We'll start leveling this out and making it like a mining operation. I downloaded several uh, mods that you can put rocks in and you can make either rock salt or lime. I also have a sell point on here that sells everything. Uh, and we're just going to do it. This is going to be our factory area, and then I'm going to get started with our farm. So let's get up there. Let's buy our treks. Let's get up there, and I'll show you where we're going to start. This is also what I downloaded, the Volvo L350 mining equipment and the shovel. It allows you to pick up everything. As you can see, it's scrolling across the bottom, as well as rocks, manure, everything. Uh, let me show you real quick what we got planned. Uh, get to the construction. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oops. <laughs> Got to go here. Sorry. Hit the wrong button. So, we're going to go to production. This is what we have going on. We got all our normal stuff that comes with the map. Let me scroll over and we get to our... Here's our things that we had on Hastings, our fermenting silo. We're going to use those. Here's the first one. I don't know how to pronounce that, but uh, what this does is... You can put these seeds in here, and then you put uh, fertilizer and water, and you can make seed pallet. And here's another one that you can make fuel. This is uh, the energy work is basically the, uh, what do you call that there, the diesel production. You put uh, canola and sunflower, wood chips, any of these bulk items you can put in there, and it will produce diesel uh enter i don't know what that is and that but uh, we'll get more into that as we get going this is another chemical one you can put any of these bulk products in there lime manure water any of them and it will produce uh herbicide fertilizer liquid fertilizer uh so this you got your fertilizer your seed all that stuff here then you've got this bad boy here and you can put rocks lime uh, beet pulp and wood chips in here and, or you can put rock and beet pulp and you can make wood chips uh, All different kinds of things. It's pretty neat And then you have this one here, which is the same one just a little bit smaller. There's a, a version one and a version two there this, There's one just holds quite a bit more um, I did not edit any of these. These are exactly the way they are. They're very cheap This is your uh, rock crusher on steroids basically you can put rock beet pulp or trees trees ready trees in here and you get wood chips out you get uh uh whatever the product of the beet pulp is rock salt and lime so this is going to be our primary thing that we're going to use uh down here at the shop and you can put in uh rocks that we're going to get a bunch of this bad boy here you put water in and you get lime so guess what? If we put this down, we can go to right over here to that pond behind us and start making lime right away. Then you take your lime and you put it in here and you make rock salt and you can sell all of it. You can sell it all right off that. This one takes lime. Then you've got these ones. Now look at forage all in one. Check this out. You put grass or hay and you're going to make silage and hay out of it. It's going to get the byproducts basically. No, 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 I'm sorry. Put uh, grass or hay, and you're going to get uh, total mixed ration. Sorry, I misspoke. Uh, then we'll go to this one. Look at this. You can put any of these bulk products in here, and you're going to get total mixed ration, a whole bunch of uh, pig food, and I don't know what this is. It tells you in-game, like if you put it down and it goes, it's not in, in different language. It's in American or English, but any of these bulk products can go in here and you get these out. 
Then you've got the rock crusher that I have on no man's land. But look at $1,248 a month. This one is free. And it's only 10000 But we can start with this one with just putting water, then lime. Then you take the lime out and you put it into here. And that makes you rock salt. So now you can sell the lime. You can sell the rock salt. You bring your rocks down and you put your rocks in here. And you can make rock salt and more lime. And so you have an overabundance. Then you take your lime that's left over. And where is the one that puts... The lime, you can also put rock in here and you get rock salt, whatever. There's one of these that put right here. You can put lime in here and you get your fertilizer and all that stuff out. So see how it works? We're going to have a whole, see, that's what that looks like. All right, so let's buy our Trex first so that we can get going here. Uh tricks and i want to i'm going to go a new holland farm i think this time so um let's do the new holland blue now see that six hundred and one thousand dollars so i've got to start making money over on the map here you sell your logs here and your wood chips all in the same spot so you bring your logs you put them up on this thing and then you click that it'll sell your logs or uh this goes out to Creighton too. You can bring your trailer right here. Boom. Leave your trailer and then click that and it'll sell it right off your trailer. You don't have to offload them. Uh, I'll put a link to the description, but I will I will put a little disclaimer in there. When you click the link, it will download all of FDR's maps. and all, or Yes, and right now he's got one. But if you download his mods, it will download all of them. When you go to his website, it'll say, would you like to sign up as a Patreon? Go down to the bottom, follow my cursor, ready? Down to the bottom of the screen and say, just take me to the mods. And you click that and then you it'll it'll automatically download. So be aware. And it's a pretty big file. It's like uh, one gig for all of his equipment. And it's like, this map is tiny though. This map's only like 95 megabytes for your PC. It is not going to be for console. It's going to be just for PC only. Uh, I did not get a chance to get a trivia question going today, uh, and I did not look up the answer for the other trivia. Remember, I've got the book that, um, didn't I, where's my treks? Where's my treks? Did I, I did buy it, right? Oh, wait, because I only have 400, wait a minute. What happened here? Oh, wait. Yeah, it's only $419. How come, did I start on start from scratch? I think I did. All right, so we got to take a loan out. I might have started on start from scratch and didn't think anything of it. My fault. Eighty-four degrees already. Where is my thing to get a loan? All right, where the heck is this? <laughs> uh, Fury's getting frustrated. Can you not take? There it is. We've got to get to 600,000, 601,000. That's why. Let's go ahead and max this out. Uh, I think I started on start from scratch by accident. I wanted the middle one because now we're going to go get our tricks. Horse three machines. And let's go down to blue. Uh, New Holland. Look, check that out. It's kind of nice, actually. There she is. All right. So, where I've got planned starting uh, is up here. We're going to start at number one. Right here, we're going to start working at clearing out this whole section. And that's going to be our farm first. And then when we get to the mountains here, we'll bring our bucket loader and stuff up. But right now, let's make some money on some wood chips and uh there zoom out a little bit all 
This thing inside, you guys. If you, yeah, that's right. I did give a review on this, on Hastings. I'm not gonna lie. I was very, very disappointed with Hastings. Uh, some, but you know, as a friend of mine told me, sometimes there's no issues until you have the issues, and then all of a sudden, boom. But look at this map. Extremely, extremely well tested. Extremely well done. Extremely low graphical. Uh, I turned my FPS off, but I have it on my screen, on my sim dashboard, and I'm pegged at 61. It's supposed to be 60, but you see it's different kind of trees. And what FDR did is he put uh, all different kinds of trees. There's even a swamp on this one. There's dead trees. There's live trees. There's young trees. There's old trees. And if you see, most of this section is flat. So we're, this is where we're going to make our farm. And we're going to start with our fields and get going like that. But I'll tell you, some of those productions that I downloaded are pretty cool. Okay, I got to play till 2 o'clock. Forgot to start my timer. All right, remember, you hit O to unfold the pipe. Now watch this. What I do... Sorry. Just, uh, got a hair on my tongue. <laughs> uh, what I do is I go in here... And then I get this nice and level to the ground. Bring it up, bring it up, bring it up. Get it square. As you can see, now she's ready to go. And we're going to start. We're going to go right straight across here and then back towards the road. And this is where we're going to build our farm back in this woods over here. So let's turn this on. As you can see, watch this. Done. Done. See, this is what I was looking at two at once. Boom. Boom. This is what I was trying to tell Creighton. Uh, as much as I don't like logging, this makes logging fun. You can clear land really quick, and you're making money. You're not making unlike the, what you would off the logs, no. But you are making some money. But I hope you guys are doing awesome tonight. I'm doing great. I'm doing awesome. I'm doing fantastic. Each time it's going to get a little bit longer. See, this way we can spend our time farming, but we're still making money. And I think one of those production things takes wood chips. I think is a bulk. I'm going to have to look. Um... When we get going. I don't know how many trees are on this map. But uh, we're going to... There's two here. Watch this. I'm going to get both of them. Bink. Bink. But I had a... a uh, probably... Uh, probably seven or eight of you guys ask me to... That you, look, you, you prefer the longer videos. Uh, I know Holden did... For sure, because I remember his name. Uh, the time lapses, uh, I don't know. Maybe I need just a little bit more work at them as far as editing them. But uh, I told him the same thing. I watch everybody's time lapses, but I find myself clicking through them too. It's, it's kind of like, eh, I can watch these any day. There's not much going on. It's just you're watching somebody... Um, just going around in a circle. But you see how much faster this is? I mean, we got 53,000 liters already. This map is absolutely one of the most... This is more stable than No Man's Land. But uh, FDR, the, the reason I like him, and Grizzly Bear Sims and I have talked in depth about this. Instead of releasing this to the public and letting us test it, he went ahead and tested it. Uh, over a thousand hours of testing went into this map so it works because you would have found an issue by then because look what happened on Hastings I found an issue within 12 hours now if you go in to the cab like I showed you guys with this thing okay you can um, you can get it perfect and as you can see it's getting the stumps all at once and it's really, really fast. I mean, just like that, we've cut down. 
Uh, oh, it only says three. <laughs> that's funny. Well, that's not accurate. I think if we were going to get an accurate tree count, maybe this just deletes them. Yeah. Let's see. We played 21 minutes. All right. Now, just so everybody knows, there will be... This is going to be my realistic time lapse, except... Or not time lapse. Let's play, except for the fact of, like, this machine. But I'm not going to do the logging without it. This is just the way it's going to be. Uh, so this is pretty much going to be the only unrealistic piece of equipment that we have. And we're going to have to deal with it. But it's going to be a... I'm going to play right where we left off. There's not going to be playing any ahead. So there will be two episodes per day. And we're doing three days three days per month. Uh, because I was only going to do one at first, but then I thought, i got to be a little bit more extreme than everyone else. I don't have to do 28. Uh, the other thing is, too, is that um, the only reason I won't probably ever do 28 again is, look what's happening on No Man's Land. Uh, we're at day 16, and I still don't have any strawberries because it goes by the days of the month. Look how quickly I'm just eating these trees up. Remember, this holds 2 million. But what we'll do to, to make it a little more realistic is we'll go down and we'll get a trailer. And I don't think I have enough to get a semi and a trailer now. Maybe I do try to keep this at the same thing but see we're going to have enough space to build our farm on the first episode because this machine is awesome and then we'll, what we'll do is when we bring our see this is going to be the cool thing like I stated we're going to bring our wheel loader in I'm not going to use the I'm going to use the wheel loader you put it on level I'll show you guys how the terraform works put it on level you drive across you get stones okay we level this and make it all level and we'll start chipping away at this. And if you notice, let's show you where we are. Okay, we're right here. Look at, we got all of this to level. Like to, to dig out for farming and uh, expand our farm that way as well as expanding your farm through far forestry. This map is just absolutely set up for my, my let's play style for sure I definitely don't think I have enough for the wheel loader yet let alone and the rock crusher even though the rock crusher is only 10,000 but what I could do though is put down the one that only takes water so that we get start getting lime right away I think I'll do that in a second here. I mean, just see. This makes life clearing trees so much easier. And it's not like you're getting nothing. You're, you're deleting a tree, but you're getting uh, wood chips. Whoever made this mod is a genius. It's just so much fun, too. It's just like... You're not, you can talk, you're not playing around. You're still saying, okay, I'm going to clear this much area today. And look at, just in the few minutes we've been doing it, look, we already clear all the way around it here. That is awesome. Let's see, we want to keep it like right about here. And I'll never adjust the top of the, the, the front of this again. This is set up for all the trees. I may have to adjust it when we go up the hill. Because I don't know how it's going to. Because we got trees up, up the hill. This map reminds me a lot of. Uh, uh, Grizzly. Isn't that. Isn't that his other map that he did. Go right here.
<laughs> it's just so fun. But like I said, I won't sacrifice the realistic speeds this go around. But we are going to stay at the 6x speed in only three days. If it takes us three days to harvest the field, it's going to take us three days to harvest the field. But I will be able to, I can tell you right now, I will have enough money, though, after selling. Because I'll tell you, on this map, uh, with the sell point, uh, 19,000 liters of lime, which is what I sold before, is selling for $20,000. So you're going to have... Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of... What I got? Stuck on one? Oh, I forgot one. There. But this gives me a chance, uh, like I said, uh, when, when it gets to be uh, your subscribers, when it's more than just a one guy or two guys asking for something, it tends to be something that people want. So like I said, seven or eight of you guys have asked about making my videos longer. Uh, and as I explained to Holden, um, YouTube says, according to the analytics, that 30 minutes is about what people's attention spans are. Well, apparently my subscribers aren't normal YouTubers. <laughs> you guys like things a little bit longer and you like things a little bit more in depth and maybe it's just the way I explain them. I don't know. I, I really don't know. Um, but I'm I'm happy because I'll just as soon play longer. Um, try to keep the videos right around an hour long. And we'll play two videos a day. And right where I left off, there'll be no playing off camera. It's literally right where I left off so you guys can follow along. The other thing I found out, too, is FDR puts um, these, he puts these trees in here by hand. I mean, you want to talk about painstaking work, because I've only cut three down. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've only cut, well, I've cut six now. <laughs> oh, but you guys have seen it's it's more like probably 200. Now, this machine is realistic. The Trex is super realistic. It's realistic. Real life thing, but it doesn't collect wood chips. It just chops the... They use it more for stumps. Uh, they go through the... They don't chop trees down with it. They'll chop small trees down with it. I've seen videos on that. Well, uh, like I said, my apologies for the trivia. We'll get more of it all set up. I was more excited to get you guys going on this. So that we can get going. Like I said, I'm going to take a break from No Man's Land. I hope everybody's not disappointed. I want to go full-time on this map for a while and get away from the base game maps. And FDR is amazing. Like I said, he, uh, uh, he was posting teasers all week long because I'm subscribed to his channel and uh, follow him quite a depth. Because I do the logging maps, but I don't do the logging. I do this sort of thing. So I follow his maps. He doesn't put square, like, flat maps out. He just doesn't. There's hills. There's mountains. But we're going to have... And I'll tell you something. You guys will get a kick out of it. You get thousands and thousands and thousands of rocks. Um... In the, in the wheel loader. You get 19,000 per load. Um, and it just... It, it goes like three feet. And then you got thousands of rocks. But if you guys remember... Like if... Uh, it got me so excited. I started watching like Gold Rush. And they go through thousands and thousands and thousands of... Um, bucket loaders of dirt. Absolutely insane. That one I just drove over. So in a way, this is still kind of realistic. It's a realistic piece of equipment. It just doesn't set up realistic. You just bang into the tree and keep them going. For those of you who play truck sim, I have a question. 
Have you guys ever had a situation where your tires wore out so much that the uh, truck shut down? I was playing earlier and I was finishing up a run and I was on my way and it wasn't even very long. It was only like 246 miles. It wasn't very long at all. And my tires were red because I forgot to fix them. And all of a sudden in the middle of the highway, it just stopped and said uh, malfunction and I, and I look up at my sim dashboard and it's the red the wheels are red all right as you can see we've got 378,000 liters of wood chips already and I sold testing on the map I sold about a hundred thousand of them and it gave me about 30,000 so right now we're going to be up to about 65,000. Now we can go down and sell it with this, but I'm trying to keep it uh, somewhat realistic. He said he was uh, testing this map. Um, when Farm Sim first came out, he came on and he did the uh, the base maps for about three days. And then he started right in on his map. And uh, he's had to change it because we had an update patch. And he's probably going to have to change it again when they update again. But, I mean, in, let's see, Farm Sim came out in November. Uh, we're into almost two months already. And he's had two months solid of just testing because he takes a lot of pride in his work and I re and, and you can see the difference in uh, when I first started playing his maps back in 17 he uh, they the the engines were different because the the graphics were it was like you'd get stutters and tears. Then again, I was playing on a potato laptop, so that didn't help. Look at this. You just get so many wood chips. Get these couple here. I'm not going to use that stinking trailer either. I'm going to put a legitimate house down. We're going to do this the right way. We're going to build this map the way it should be. I'll try to get to 500,000 here. And I'd like to start selling, get them, try to get them sold before this episode is up. So we can start. Look at that so far. Look at all the way around. Oh, the other thing he did, if you noticed, remember my draw distance is at 200. But look at in the past. What he's done is see how they disappear. He did that for the graphics. We'll get to, like I said, we got about 50 more thousand here. And then we'll go down and try to buy a truck and a trailer. Well, I actually, should I buy my house? I should probably buy a truck and trailer first, huh? Because we can still buy the house second half of the day. I will be playing from 6 in the morning till 6 at night, faithfully, then we will sleep. But I did think about getting the survival thing set up. See how it just works. And we're going to bring our bucket loader, or our wheel loader down when we make enough money. And we're going to start. Because you can set up the terraform. I'll show you guys. Uh, it'll be tomorrow's episode. You can set it up to where it paints for you when you level. But this pad is level. Okay. So we're going to put our bucket loader down right about here. Wheel loader. And then you just go straight across. And you level it one strip at a time. It's slow process, but it's fun. It's actually it's pretty, it's pretty in-depth. Uh, there, they also make a excavator, but I 
Fury's old. I couldn't figure out how to use it without having to go insane. I kept picking up the bucket loader. Or the, I would pick up a load of rocks. And then I'd dump them on the ground because uh, it just did it. See, now I don't know how we're going to get up there to get those trees down. There. Now we're at 500,000 liters. Go till noon, and I think... Let's see how much a... Uh, where's our trucks? Let's see. Semi is... Uh, oh, I can get this thing. The only thing... I downloaded this, but I can't buy it yet because... Uh, check this out. This thing is sick, but it only holds 28,000. So you'd be making like 800 trips. But what I didn't do is check to see if it came with, no, I was going to say, did it come with an extension, um, to pick it up, but it's absolutely the they did a great job on it, but it only holds 28,000. But where this will come in handy is when we're doing our farm and we're doing our harvest. And then we got a uh, separate tipper. Uh, but it only holds 28,000. That's the that's the problem. But it's it's really well done. Not going to lie. Uh, it also comes with a tanker. That pack comes with this and the tanker uh, that fills with diesel, water, water. Uh, which we, we should buy that one after we sell these wood chips. Buy this and then get our lime started down with that one that one circle thing. Uh, so should we buy the Mac Anthem? Or, okay, 110. And how much is our trailer? The red one that we had. 95. So uh, 210, 205. I don't have enough. But I could buy the $75,000 one. But I don't like the long one. But we'll try it. Okay, so we'll buy this. Uh, let's make this. Oh, we can't. Oh, you know what? Wait, 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 wait. Does it hold wood chips? Darn it. All right, so that doesn't hold wood chips. That does, though. See, that holds everything. It even holds rocks. Uh, so what we're going to do is go up the trucks. Let's see if we can get one that's 93000 Let's get the Mac Pinnacle, something different. And I think I'm going to need a bigger engine, but I don't know if I can. I'm going to go with a small engine for now. There. Let's try that. And trailers. Get our red one. And it <laughs> puts us at 5,000. But let's get down here with this. Get it set up so we can drive right in here. Shut that down. You know what? I never looked at the... This looks like truck sim. <laughs> Except for I can see the mirror better. <laughs> the Mac in the in truck sim, you can't see the Alright, here we go. Our first load. We get out just a little bit more. I don't want to go crazy out. I wanna I wanna kinda keep it close. Because I made the decision that when you zoom way out, you lose a lot of the uh, immersion. I'm also going to think of our company name. I think it's going to be, uh, I don't know what we'll call it. Like Fury Machines Wood Chips or something like that. Our Fury's Hauling. And we're going to make this... Uh, uh, in a more of an immersion. So when I come back next time, it's going to be set up more where it's going to be like a, a real person doing it. Because I want to have the immersion. As you can see now, look how far we cleared. 
All the way. See how the trees disappear? That is fantastic. Go the, around the other side. And now we got room to turn around. Got to be in here to sell them. Got to have it on. See? Nope. All right. It's only 59000 Is it full? There it is. Now it is. Ooh, this needs a bigger engine. Shall we drive back in first person? See, I wish you could do this in truck sim. Because you're stuck having to have the corner mirrors up. Because I really like the Mac Type R. Here, look at the little light comes on for the headlights. I don't like the Mac Pinnacle in real life. I like the Mac Type R, and I like the Mac Anthem. Uh, but I've been using a... Oh, I can't even think of the name of it. It's a mod that I found on the workshop. And it's absolutely awesome. It's great. It's uh, On the dash, it's got your speedometer your miles all that stuff so you don't have to look around but i use my sim dashboard for that stuff anyways all right let's uh it's nice to see some blue Woo. here he's got to stop driving like that okay about 15 minutes perfect see in time six feels just a little bit slower then we got to get our uh our, um, what do you call it there? Greenhouse is going. Since the water is right there. We can go right behind here and get our greenhouses going. Once we make enough money. What do you guys guess? What do you guess? What do you guess? See, just back in here. Only, what? All right. So how much does that sell for here? That sixty thousand was only two thousand. Oh, uh, let's see. What do we go up to look at over right here? <laughs> only forty-five. And I'll bet you. Oh, because I'm on hard mode. It's all right. We'll have to work at it. So I have to keep track of. Where is our thingy here? Uh, okay, sold. 2,806. Okay, we'll have to keep track because uh, we got 500,000 liters. That was only 60,000. It'll be a few trips. I'm guessing what I'm going to guess with those low rates. Um. Uh, I'm guessing probably about 40,000 total. But it'll be enough to buy our lime machine. And then lime sells pretty good. At least it did on the what I was on. But I might have been on New Farmer too. <laughs> See, this is kind of cool. This is a really nice map. Turn my lights off. I don't know what I would ever do without some dashboard turn your lights on everything all i have to do is drive there we go 59,400. This thing is heavy. I got the real weights downloaded, and you can tell. This is like trying to use the Mac Type R. <laughs> it's like the Mac Type R in uh, Truck Sim only comes with 270 horsepower, 275 or something like that. It's, at, it's only a six speed, so my shifter, I don't have to shift like through 600 gears. Uh, this I really like, though. Let's look at X. You can see the mirrors are set up correctly. So you could technically drive like 
about well, like that to see. Alright, so this is now for 120000 It'll be another $3,000, so that'll be six grand. At least you have a way to make money now. I mean, I could technically cut all these trees down. I also, if I decided to, I downloaded a... Right here, the Ponzi Scorpion King, uh, up to 25 feet, 25 meters, I can put the logs it's pretty cool so i actually could do logging if i wanted uh am i going to probably not you guys saw how much i just cleared in the first day the first couple of uh, first hour of gameplay which reminds me got to go down to there this thing first thing i gotta do is upgrade this thing this is a dog But it's still faster than a tractor. Now I want to try something up here. I want to see if... This will take it from the side so I don't have to back in. Nope. We'll sell it, though, from there. See, at least we're making money now. I could have just came down and sold the 500000 all at once with the Trex, but... Uh, it's not... It ruins the immersion. I want to keep this as realistic as we can. Oh, I had the coolest thing happen to me today. Uh, I wanted to fill you guys in today with that. So we're, we go to the grocery store, and uh, normally people don't notice little things. But I actually had a lady refuse to give me my senior discount. I'm old enough to get a senior citizen discount. And normally I don't even ask because I don't think it's a big deal. Uh, it's only 10%, but a lady said, there's no way you look your age. There's no way you don't get a senior discount. No, 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 no. I said, uh, ma'am, <laughs> I'm old. And she goes, no, 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 you're not getting it. And she was dead serious. So I got a chuckle out of that because I thought to myself, um, that's the first time in a long time that somebody hasn't, uh, hasn't given me it i refused now this is number three so this is 180,000, and we still got uh another three trips would be 360 and then another three trips so we got about six more trips to go i want to try to get that done before the episode's over but oh you know what we should do before we check should see what factory takes the wood chip bulk and makes something out of it because we should be doing that because i guarantee you if you can make like uh fertilizer or compost or something out of it that'll sell for a heck of a lot more than wood chips will and that's what i'm going for is i want to start making like the lime and the rock salt and things because it will sell more than the wood chips and lime is expensive to buy it because you're and your tractors go through it quite a bit. Got about another hour yet. All right, so let's get to... Whoops, wrong one. Doo, 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 doo. Oh, I can get the Volvo tanker for only 81000 And that thing's fast, but that only holds 28000 We don't have that. You watch now. Oh, so what I was going to do. <laughs> Sorry. Uh... Construction, production. Let's go and see what those bulk ones are. Okay, that takes that. That takes that. 
that wood chips? I think it is. Well, we're going to put one of these down right now. Uh, especially if I get fuel from it. Not enough money. It's $10,000. I don't know. I'll have to look into that. But that's the first one I'm going to put down because I could dump a load of wood chips in there. No, wait. No, that didn't take wood chips. Fury's not thinking correctly. That doesn't take wood chips, so it's a good thing we didn't do that. Wood chips are the... Oh, I downloaded the thing that tells me what it is now. Uh, let's see where... This one? No, that's not wood chips. That's beet pulp. Uh, that's lime. That's that. That's that. Uh, that's beet pulp. This is the one thing I want to do right here. First. Get this water and you get lime. Then we'll take the lime and we'll put it in here. And we'll we'll have rock salt and lime. Uh, grass, hay. Grass, hay. Uh, right here. Is wood chips one of them? No. Uh, do, 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 do. I know I think that's silage. Okay. No biggie. I thought for sure there was going to be something we could put wood chips in, but that's okay. We'll sell them away. We got lots and lots and lots of them, and we're going to have lots and lots of rocks. Trust me. Let's spin in. Do, 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 do. So see, this isn't like a crazy amount of money, but I remember when uh, Craden and I were playing on that one logging map and he had come to me a couple of times and he's like, oh my gosh, I'm only getting like $10,000 per load. And I'm like, what? Like, he was getting, like, 20, but then he dropped all the way down to, like, 10 because it was selling. But, uh, to me... Ah, oh, now let's see something. Uh, maybe this is what I was thinking. Okay, rocks. There's where you can sell your lime. This is sells everything, right? Yeah, it just doesn't spin. Let's uh let's see if we get a better price for let's see if we can get a better price for wood chips. Uh, do, 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 do. uh <laughs> same price. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> oh, Fury's trying to think ahead, and I just spent five thousand that I didn't really have yet. Sorry, it gives us a chance to put our lime and stuff in there now. But the good news is, I don't know why I picked start from scratch, but we did. Now it's going to be a real hard work to get where we need to be, but we'll get there because once you start selling lime, I think it's more like a hundred dollars, be like double than wood chips, if not triple. A um, hundred dollars or two hundred dollars. Oh, you know what? We can check. Let's go here and go to lime. See, silage now will sell for one fifty-three. Diesel will sell for. Look at that. See. We got to get that one that sells diesel. Look at 1,264 per liter. Okay. Road salt. They're not buying it right now. Flour, bread, cake, butter. Where is lime? Look, canola oil, 1,400. That one thing makes canola and sunflower oil. $480 for $237 for strawberries. Uh, lime. 
222 so it's about $100 more. Look, stones will sell there for 52 herbs, herbicide. That's what we got to make too. So all these things will go over and we'll make them, we'll try to make the most expensive thing because if it's selling for 1000 I mean, think about instead of $3,000 a load, now you're making, because uh, these, these wood chips are only selling for $45 a ton or per thousand. So if we, even if we get up to $200, um, now you're starting to triple and quadruple your money quick. go this be a good chance to test that shut that down because this be the last load we'll test that sell point too but look how much we cleared in one day one hour's worth and that's why I like it I like playing a lot longer because it gives me a chance to do something when it's 30 minutes and you you're coming on you're doing your trivia and you're getting all set up most of the time you're um you're spending like five or ten minutes doing your setup and then five or ten minutes to say goodbye it's absolutely insane this way and plus i think that six times it just feels a lot better we're almost at two o'clock in the afternoon and uh it just feels better then i'll come and i'll play from two until eight and then we'll sleep or fast forward time one of the two until we buy a house but I think the smart thing to do is I can always fast forward time through the night the smart thing to do is get these productions going pretty quick we put that right in the way didn't I there check that out Let's get a little ahead further. Hey, we're selling, we're making money. Ah, see, that was 26 instead of 23. Ooh, I hit the fence, I hit the thingy. All right, we're going to wrap it up right there, everyone. I hope you guys love this series because I am. This is the most excited I've been in a long, long time. Doesn't tell me what it sells, but it does sell everything. That's what that all in one means. All right, so on that note, we're going to wrap this up here. I hope you like it. Like I said, I just got done telling you guys I'm super excited. It doesn't look like the trees are very dense by looking at this, but it's actually, as you guys saw, it's actually pretty sick as far as denseness. And I think what I'll do is, uh, I don't know, we'll figure it out as we go, but I'm going to start right up right here right when we left off, just so you guys know, there's not going to be any playing off camera. There's not going to be nothing. I want you guys to be involved with everything. This is going to be our farming slash mining slash um factories this whole section over here will be factories and then we'll start farming we'll have animals we'll do the whole nine yards and on that note be sure to look out for yourselves look out for each other and be sure to most importantly look out for each other's families enjoy the night the day the weekend whenever you're watching this please 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 like and subscribe and share 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 and on that note fury machine we'll catch everyone on the flip side have a great one everyone